What's up, guys? Welcome back to Third Person. This is the Third Person Podcast. My name is Chris, and with me as always are my buddies, Jesse and Mike. How's it going? <laughs> What's up? Guys, we're doing something, uh, just another little what-if thing here real quick, and I'm sure you've seen this on the internet. This We're going to be talking about Old Man Carl, or what we're going to call What If Carl Was a Lone Survivor. And, again, you guys probably seen uh, this theory or whatever, and you saw there's these images that are, if you look down below, I'll probably pop it down below, but you see these images going around, some really good artwork for what, yeah. you know, for Old Man Carl. And uh, we wanted to j- kind of jump on this bandwagon because we kind of really like this idea. So this is going to be kind of a different what if. We're, we're, we don't really have anything to say. Source material. Yeah, we just kind of like want to talk about it because, you know, and I guess I'll go first here is I, I just really, I enjoy the, the thought. Not just the concept of it, but I enjoy the thought of like, because Carl is our youngest character, not counting his sister Judith. But, yeah. you know, Carl is, is obviously the youngest, you know, survivor there. And what will, ha- like, what will happen? When I first saw that, I was like, you know what? That's a really cool thing to think about. What's going to happen when he does get in his 40s if he makes it that, you know? So, yeah. so is, is his I mean, dad going to be alive? He has beard there, so. Well, that's what I'm saying. But I'm just saying, like, in, in my thoughts in general, before the whole, you know, before that image came out and stuff, like, when you mm-hmm. think about it. So I don't know. I mean, I you know I don't really have many predictions. Just that it, yeah. if you want to if you want to look at this image and you want to go by that, obviously we can make many many uh, draw many conclusions. Being that he's taken on the gear and probably personas of you know all of these characters. Um, I will point out the fact that in this image he does have his eye covered, right? Yeah, and, you and know, he has Lucille. So. But that's my point. You know, he doesn't unless he goes back to covering his eye, because as of as of right now, if you're if you're caught up on the comics and, you know, not spoil, it's not really much of a spoiler. But, you know, in the comics, he his bad his his the thing is off his his eye, the bandage off his eye in the show. Did he put it back on? No, the bandage. Yeah, he put it back on. But the bandage is off in the image, isn't it? In the grown up Carl pick. It's off. Isn't yeah, it's off. Oh, that's true. Right. Yeah, yeah it's all. It looks like an eye patch, but that's just as open. Wound. It's just because it's, it's just a black. <laughs> I thought it was an eye patch. Hole. Yeah, yeah. No, when I first saw this it's image, I thought it was, I thought it was um, definitely done brilliantly. I mean, with him standing on the skulls and and uh, you know everybody else's weapons and and I just thought it was. Um, I think we'll we'll put some credit for uh, the artist. Um, in the in down below, or or we'll we'll mark that somehow. But for me, Carl being one of the last survivors would definitely make sense because of the people that he's been around. Like Chris said, with the characters that he's that he's had around him, his dad, Michonne, and 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 Daryl, and and all these other characters, and Glenn, and just not even the physical part of it, the physical attributes that he can learn from these people, but a lot of the. Um, like that realistic keep your humanity kind of um, uh, you know traits that he that he he got from from Dale, you know what are you laughing about? So I just I don't I'm reading the comments on this where we were looking at this images and someone <laughs> says Carl Grimes is a fucking asshole. There's no way <laughs> there's no way somebody that whiny and stupid could grow into the, the badass yeah. illustrated in these sketches. Fuck Carl Grimes, stupid hey, bitch ass. <laughs> that's fucked up. So was ranting about <laughs> really? Carl and the. <laughs> In the, in the... <laughs> Stupid bitch ass. Yeah, Fuck that's all messed up. Oh, God, Hey, dude. dude I, I don't mean, agree it, with that it, though. It, yeah, it, no. it makes sense. It makes sense because unlike the adults that we first were introduced in the show, he's kind of dealt with this world right, since yeah. he was like ten years old. He's been molded you know? into this world, whereas adults exactly. are probably still holding exactly. on to like, oh, I remember when I used to watch Netflix. Remember when you I know, watched? Like... Yeah, I remember Christmas mornings and all. He 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 kind of. If in fact it is, he is forty years old, fifty years old, or whatever he can possibly I'm just saying, be, that doesn't have to be, whatever. Yeah. Think about it. an, an yeah. age, an older age. You know, it doesn't oh, have to yeah. be according to this picture. And though. who knows? You know, what's even cool too to think about. Who knows if Carl does make it to this age? Okay, this is what is he now? Fifteen? What is he really supposed to really be? Fifteen, sixteen, right? In the I think he's like, even like fourteen. All right, so say he's 13 14, or 14, 15 yeah. years old. That's another 30 years or so into the future. Who knows what the world will be like? Will there ever be a cure? Will there ever be a safe haven? You know what I mean? That's something cool to think about. 
You know what I mean? Even what if, do you guys think if, about even, that? The zombies are going to die out, but there's always going to be zombies because whoever's unless, left, someone's going to get infected. Unless you know? there is some kind of cure or... The only cure is Carl, death. Yeah, the cure is going to be death. Is, yeah, like, you know... No, but not necessarily. But if you die, you don't you don't turn. Well, you're saying like a cure for when you're still alive, it it it, exactly. it eradicates whatever disease or, is in you. Yeah. We we've heard, and there's there's been a lot of the theories about this before. Is is anyone immune? Right. It would be interesting if he would be that one to have some kind of immunity, or possibly Judith, since she was born when this already. You know, uh, when the apocalypse already taken effect, she was born into this. You, who knows? They can always throw that cool little. Oh wow, that's a kind of an interesting thing. theory. The fact yeah. that she was born, she was conceived. During it. She was conceived. Yeah. And born, would she would she have an immunity to it? Yeah. No, well, no, no. Can, we're they... throwing around immunities here. I want our future ponytail wearing Eugene to have that immunity. <laughs> no, sorry, man. He won't. Yeah, sorry. He's yeah, already, yeah, no, no, that that ship sailed for it, him. It's man. a long shot. Yeah, no, that's. I, yeah, I was I always think thinking so. that Daryl could be that last guy because they made even be. little hints to that. Remember with Beth and Daryl when yeah. they were doing yeah. the moonshine thing? Yeah. Daryl was like, "You'll beat this," you know, because Daryl was down on himself about not being able to save Herschel. I could have saved Herschel and all this kind of stuff. What do you laugh at? Down on Herschel? No, no, <laughs> no. The uh, the moonshine. I'm I'm just yeah. thinking, what what if back in the country woods? There's just a bunch of people that are immune because we got our moonshine here. It's 100% alcohol. <laughs> not going to drink it all. Moonshine will kill it. Yeah. Moonshine kills that disease. Don't yeah. you worry moonshine about Moonshine kills everything. Yeah. It's like put some tussin on it. What was that? Yeah. Um, what comedian said that? Just We cured everything back in the day. My mama just said, put some tussin on it. You fell down, <laughs> you fell down in the road, put some tussin yeah. on it. You know? Yeah, so who knows? It's a fun little thing to think about, but I remember Beth saying, you'll beat this, you'll be the last one, Daryl Dixon, this whole this whole thing. I think So I remember yeah. them always hinting to that. But I don't think I don't think he meant... Oh, you mean yeah. as, as a survivor of the group? Daryl will be the last one in that yeah, group. Yeah, yeah. You know, I always thought that that was a little hint to that, but obviously we're not talking about Daryl being the, the, the yeah. survivor. So what do you guys think? I mean, well, I kind of said kinda... what I needed to say. Jesse, so what do you think? If he is the lone survivor, and I'm I'm gonna base mine solely off that picture there because I don't see Judith's like pacifier or anything like that. So I'm assuming she's alive too. So she, he's not the lone well, survivor. Probably. She'd be in her thirties, man. <laughs> what that mean? or well, I'm, I'm just saying she didn't die. She didn't die. Comic, You're saying she didn't die. If we follow yeah. the comic opposed to the show, yeah, we already know what happens to Judith. So she's dead. She, but, she yeah, doesn't yeah. exist. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, if this is Comic Carl, then it's understandable. If it's not Comic Carl, there'd be some kind of, you know, artifact there of Judith's. But the thing that I'm thinking about most is what would he sound like? <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, that, so, that Rick Grimes got a draw. I, I was thinking, so you guys have seen the reboot of True Grit, right? The one with um, Jeff Bridges. Yeah. Um, not me. Talking no. good wow. down on his yeah. luck and. And get and gets real gruff and talking like this and yeah. yeah, somewhat like Forrest Gump with a speech impediment, more so. Uh, <laughs> that, that's what I'm imagining for some reason, and it fits. I could just see Carl, yeah, stupid walkers, just going around swinging Michonne's sword. So, if he is the last survivor, I think it's well deserved, possibly, if it's Comet Carl. Well, show Carl well, has a lot to live can... up to. Can I can I throw a wrench? My turn to throw a wrench. Throw a uh -oh. wrench. I don't care. This technically can't be Comic Carl. Oh, this is true. Why? Because he has Daryl's poncho. Nope. That's one reason. That could be one reason, but I was mainly talking about Lucille. That's true. Lucille. That was destroyed, is true right? too. Remember? Not to say. Well, we, not to say he. I can't was going to mention that earlier, but I was going to avoid mentioning that because I was wanting to avoid spoilers. Comic spoilers. 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 Rah, rah, rah. Uh, fuck it. Point is. I mean, of course, he could always just remake a new one. So, and maybe it's just, and maybe it's, it's uh, because maybe Negan makes a new one. Well, well, you know, maybe think about it. it the, let's talk about the, the the underlying tones of this image, okay? For me, who are the people that shaped who that man is? And it's his Sean dad. Paul, Rick, it's Michonne, Daryl, and it's yeah. it's Negan. Negan is the one yeah. that makes him take off the fucking 
uh, bandana. And he says, yeah. be who you are. You know, his father, he, he looks up to his father, obviously. And Michonne, it was a mother to him. You know? Um, <laughs> he so, also says, sing me a song. And he started going, I killed a gingerbread boy. <laughs> yeah, oh my God. Did you get your job, dude? That was great, man. Yeah. Um, but I mean, yeah, so, 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 yeah, so he could have, you know, if it could be Carmic Carl. And he and he just in remembrance remembrance of Negan because I assume Negan's gonna get fucking killed yeah. at some point not Probably. by Rick I don't think he'll get killed by Rick but I think he's gonna die, um, mm. but you know what I'm saying so yeah so yeah. yeah it could be so it definitely could be though I you know uh, just you know like I said off the bat you know <laughs> no pun intended on that God dang it well, like you said you know I mean without <laughs> getting too crazy and too deep into what the artist was trying to 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 depict to, 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 to us or whatever you know. Like you, like one of you guys just said that maybe he made his own. He could, you know yeah. I mean? he could, like it I said, mean, remember, it. right? Exactly. Regardless, that's not the yeah. point. The point is, is the it's a cool fucking, idea. Yeah, it's, it's a, a really picture. fun and, and awesome idea. And and yeah. I mean that right there, Kirkman can look at that and be like, holy shit, that could fucking be grab some ideas. An alternate, from it. yeah, that could be an alternate timeline. Like imagine, imagine like a year from now that fucking comic comes out called Old Man Carl. Just just whatever, right? And it's like. And so now he's end capping his Walking Dead, but it doesn't mean because that can yeah. go. It doesn't, you know. It's like well, it's then like, supposedly he he says um, it. He has uh, I think three hundred issues. He said he wants to go with it. Yeah, but he doesn't have an ending planned at all, or but, a vaccine. But what or anything I'm saying, like that. he said he know. No, he says he knows exactly where he's going to go with it, but no one knows. But, but that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like we could like this. Like, wouldn't it be dope if he had this? If he came out with a series of Old Man Carl running alongside the this original series and it's like oh shit well that starts years after this se- the original series ends however I he's going to end it going it. while the the, the oh, they do, dude, they, so much they do the that end, all the time they do over, it all the time yeah but why why mess with a good thing you know i can't yeah. see just saying is, if, yeah. if let's just say when it does end and then it goes to something like old man That's carl story. you know yeah. i'm just trying yeah, to make it be, a little trying to yeah. I'm trying to mix it up a little guys all right you know trust me well, they have well, 18 let's, different let's, batman series is going on at the same time yeah I was reading wow. five different Batman series last month, and it's like, okay, you know, like, uh, but you got it's comics for you, man. You know, that's well, let's get some of some of the viewers' ideas too. They can write down in the in the comments below and just give us some ideas what you know what you guys think, um, you know, the of, of the art and what you think of um, our our idea of Carl, you know, and many other YouTubers' ideas about Carl being that last man. Right in there, and uh, and let us know what you guys think. But it's def- definitely, like I said, you know, it's a, it's an awesome piece of art with him standing on the pile of skulls and everything like that. It's it's definitely a cool um, a cool idea. Cool idea. You know, great idea. Yeah, definitely. Um, and yeah. let's hope that Kirkman doesn't pull a George R. R. Martin and take you know twenty years to write the sixth book. Uh, I don't Please. think so. Please, yeah. Kirkman knows what he's doing. So. He's good. Yeah. Um, but uh, really quick, guys, I just wanted to go ahead and um, mention, uh, don't forget that we do have uh, a promo for comicblitz.com if you guys wanted to get in right. there and get some comics. You get you get your first three months for $1 a month, so you're paying $3 for three months worth of unlimited comics. Just wanted to mention that for you. Uh, so if you're looking into that, since we're talking about the comics, get in there yep. if you want to catch up on some well, comics. Well, they don't have Walking Dead. They don't have Walking Dead as of yet, but... You can still check Bastards. out some other awesome, awesome comics. So again, third person pod is a promo code. Go to comicblitz.com. Check that out. Yeah. And that's gonna do it for us here on the on this on this what if. And damn it, Carl, old, old, he's, he's old, but he's, he's an old guy. But he's a badass. Swing, man, bye. <laughs> that's it, guys. We're gonna see you on the next episode. Thanks for everything. We love you guys. Peace out. <laughs>